I loved High Desert. You guys are incredible. This is going to be awesome. Thank you. I was absolutely living for it. And one of my favorite, favorite sequences in High Desert is this Western pioneer world um, <laughs> when Diane and Stuart show up to understand what Peggy has been doing this whole time. And I just want to know what your favorite memory of that day on set would be. I mean, you know what's crazy is that it, not only was it our first day of shooting, but it was the first day of the whole series. Show, yeah. of the whole series was that was shooting in, in the in the Pioneer Town Western set. I mean, so much of our job was done for us because we just had to react to what was happening. I mean, not only did you have like stunt guys flipping off of balconies <laughs> and people breaking like glass and stuff, but then we also had. Patricia Arquette, Peggy, right? Like <laughs> hanging from a chandelier going from, you know, th across the ceiling. It was like waving uh, to us yeah. <laughs> with a smile. Yeah, it was like, like she's just hooked up to these. And, and some amazing, by the way, like that's not an easy, she makes it look easy, yeah, yeah, but yeah. I would not have been psyched no. to have to get harnessed in and swing no. down and then get out of it, and start gun firing. <laughs> and she, like, Patri that's just like Patricia. She is so all in and committed. And um, yeah, it was, that was one of the most fun, so fun. sets. So fun, so surreal. <laughs> so fun to watch. Yeah. So yeah. I'm so right. happy that it was different. Fun to right. um, so Diane and Stewart are, pretty, I would say, fed up with Peggy's choices at this point. But over the course of the season, were there any moments that you were just hoping that Peggy would prove Diane and Stuart wrong? Oh my gosh, constantly. <laughs> I feel like we're constantly just tr just hoping, praying, right? What is like the definition of insanity? You're right, is like, when you keep repeating the same- And getting the same, same results result. every time. I mean, that is exactly what happened. I think from birth, it's like she's just been putting us through these weird trials and but we constantly continually show up. Yeah, they show up to- Hoping for a different result. Her work with a plant, right. thinking like, this is the little welcome <laughs> right. gift and it's gonna go well. And that ends in chaos yeah. in a shattered windshield. Right? Yeah. <laughs> Diane's windshield gets shattered. But you know what? Like, what's cool about that is the other side of that is that it shows how much we love her yeah. and how much love is in our family, you know, through thick or thin. It's kind of, we will always be there, no matter, no matter how much I talk about cutting her out. It's, yeah, 100%. So for Christine, I have to ask you have this incredible scene with Bernadette and Patricia in the Pioneer Town. Walk me through that. What what were the nerves like? Were you freaking out? I, I yes, <laughs> all of it. Because number one, it is me having a a, a scene with Patricia Arquette and mm. the iconic Bernadette Peters. Now, thankfully, Bernadette mostly just keeps her eyes closed the, during the scene while I <laughs> talk to her the whole time, so I didn't have to like make total eye contact. But we had, it was, you know, I, I, I give all credit to Jay Roach and, and our writers because the, the, as written, it was such a beautiful scene. And I, you know, they really just sort of let us have it. And then what makes me laugh so much is how angry Patricia is getting with Bernadette's character. Like, it's just this sort of like dichotomy of like this mo so emotional great. moment with Patricia just wanting to carry out her plan. Um, you know, but I do like the fact, again, it's similar to what you said. It's like Diane does show up to do this. You know, Patricia mm. kind of lures her in and, and lies to her to get her there. But then she just said, all right, I'll do this. I'll yeah. do this for you and promise me A, B, C, D. And I think it really is, it, there is a sort of, you know, a, a, she cracks Diane's shell a little bit there. Yeah. And I think Diane is suddenly sort of recognizing that she's been bottling up a lot, you mm. know, grief is a lot. And I don't think she's handled it the same way Peggy's handled it. So I think it it is a really, it was a great little opportunity. And yes, I freaked out. I was nervous. I, you know, they were so great. And I, of course, when it was over, I was like, I second guessed all of it. I was like, did I even say the right mm. lines? Did I, but it was you so much absolutely fun. Absolutely incredible you both oh, were I, I cannot wait for the world to see this and for this to blow up high desert is amazing so thank you so much for talking to me thank, thank you, you. Thank you. <laughs> phenomenal we love you. Right. you thank you <laughs> have amazing. a great one bye